Hi, this is Orange Hedgehog 2012 and today I'm going to be doing a plush review on the Sonic X Volume 1 Cream the Rabbit. Um, this is my third video from the the Volume 1 series that I'm going to be doing. Um, this, uh, yeah, so if we get started on with the, uh, the review. Now, this is what I like actually, I have noticed that her nose is actually plastic um, along with tails as well which is quite nice um, I assumed that because the, the eyes were stitched that the nose was going to be stitched as well but obviously not but if we, have a, if we start off with her head first um, they've done a very similar thing with um, Rouge's eyeliner this part here is um, made from like a black velvet material and it's really quite soft and they've done the same for the other side but I have noticed on my one that the glue has come away so you have to be careful of that but the, the stitch work on her eyes they're quite good very nice and they've done the same for her mouth uh, nothing you know special it's just um a brown color for her mouth that has been stitched her nose is like a brown plastic that they've used and the orange part around her eye which is cool she's got a very similar thing with, with shadow but obviously this is orange it goes all the way to the back of her head she has her original gold hang string and they've used like a blue light blue sort of um sort of almost like silk sort of type material for her bow and this the white part it's almost it feels like velvety a little bit which is quite nice nice detailing her dress is just sort of basic synthetic material they've included her underwear as well but yeah um this is her tag and um not all these characters were made um from this series um amy wasn't neither was big um Eggman, um, Rouge and Shadow were from the, the Volume 2 series which I'll be reviewing later on. Um, obviously it's got the Sonic X in Japanese and the same again down there but also I'm not sure what that section says. Plushies or plushies I'm not entirely sure. But that's the front and the back of her tag. It just has some warning signs in Japanese and the Sega Prize logo with the website 2003 Made in China which is when these plushies were made so if we go further down these are her legs they've been nicely stuffed um, her white socks as you can see in the inside part and her shoes there's nothing that much detail on there it's pretty basic yellow and orange com combination the vinyl on, vinyl on her shoes is just sort of like a darker grey material and the same the same for her right so if I flip her over these are ears now they're not loose um, they've actually been stitched so that's the the back part of her ears and the same as well for her right that sort of detail at the back and the white part again which is a nice I like what they've done there they've added sort of like a velvet sort of white material it's her tail And then that's that's really sort of like the back of her, really. So yeah. Oh, and also I forgot to mention her gloves. 
her little yellow buckle thing. They can be if you're not careful they I assume they they if you're not careful they can come off. These are her gloves. So yeah. I think that's pretty much it for her. There's not really that much detail to go in. It's a nice cute plush. Um there is one on eBay. I think there's a couple at the moment on eBay. One you can get from Japan. But she is quite expensive. I think she's about seventy odd pounds. I mean I didn't pay that much. I only paid about sort of fifty dollars for her. Um which is sort of around about sort of twenty five, thirty pounds, something like that. So not that not that expensive. Um you know, I you know, a lot of people say that these these might be rare or something. I don't think they are personally. They're just hard to get a hold of, I think, personally. But that's my own own personal opinion. But yeah, if you ever come across her and you have the money, you know, these are great to go in your collection, especially from the, the Sonic X series, which I don't think they're you know, I think the series is pretty much finished. You know, whether they're going to make um, a fourth se season, I think. I'm not entirely sure. But, yeah, that's been my review on Cream the Rabbit. Um, if you want to check out my channel, I've got other plush reviews. If you'd like to comment or subscribe, that would be great. And um, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.